is Filipino food healthy? The Mediterranean and Japanese diet have been known to be a healthy diet to follow, one that has the capability to bring a long and healthy life to one that follows it. These cultures are known around the world for the delicious and nutritious food. Is it the same for Filipino food? Is Filipino food healthy? When you're first introduced to Filipino food, it doesn't seem that healthy. Some of their most popular dishes, succulent whole roasted pork or tender cuts of meat lying in salty and oily sauces, with small bowls on the side filled with white or fried rice with soy sauce, fish sauce, or vinegar alongside. Even their vegetable dishes don't seem that healthy since their vegetables are hardly ever eaten raw. You may argue that no one eats Filipino food to be healthy. Just like most foods around the world, there are both healthy and unhealthy things about any culture's diet. To understand how Filipino food is healthy, let's focus on the unhealthy factors first. Usually, Filipino dishes include frying, sauteing, stewing, and grilling. Frying in oil is the main problem when it comes to cooking unhealthy, and most Filipino recipes use a lot of oil. Pan frying or deep frying food is a common way of cooking in the Philippines for several reasons. One, it's quick and easy. Two, there's no need for an oven or a kitchen with everything and its mother in it. And three, you just need a stovetop with a pan or a wok. It gets rid of all the germs in the food. Fried food tends to last longer. While leaving fried food out isn't the best or the healthiest thing to do, it has a lot less bad consequences. This is why many Filipinos tend to do this. Many dishes use a lot of salt, vinegar, and sugar. Filipino food is often high in salt and includes sugary desserts and drinks. Plus, most Filipino dishes use white rice with their meals. Filipino soups and stews can be very healthy meals on their own, but it changes if eaten with a lot of white rice. This can cause health problems like diabetes, heart disease, and obesity. Soups and stews like sinigang, pachero, or tinola are healthy, nutritious, and filling. Here's a tip. Don't eat too much white rice. Try using brown rice instead. Stay away from overcooking the vegetables in these soups so you retain the vitamins and nutrients. There's no need to stop eating Filipino food. It's not the end of the world to eat one of their popular dishes every once in a while. Just don't do it all the time. To be more healthy when eating Filipino food, choose dishes like pinabot, tinola, synagogue, and lang to get that awesome Filipino taste while eating your diet rich in vegetables. I hope some of these tips that we left in the video help you so you can eat your favorite Filipino meals without jeopardizing your health. Let us know your healthy diet tips in the comments. Hit the like button below the video and share it with your friends. To see more videos like this, then click subscribe. <laughs>